Hey guys, Leash here. Wanted to jump in tonight and do a Facebook Live based on Facebook Lives. Um, so just basically sharing our journey over the last uh, 13 days of doing these Facebook Lives and just what they've done in terms of helping you guys understand the platform and the power of Facebook Live. So Facebook Live is live streaming. Uh, it's basically jumping onto your business page or your personal page or your group and sharing something of value to people's lives. Preferably, you can share whatever you like. Um, let's hope it's valuable. Uh, and basically, the reason we've been doing these live is to test and measure a little bit of what works for you guys because we're always about innovation and we know that nothing ever stays the same. Often, they're going to be the similar principles that are taught throughout, regardless of age or time or how long they've been around. And hey, James, great to see you on here. Um, however, there's going to be things that change, and Facebook Lives are one of them. So they came around about 12 months ago, um, and Facebook is all about connection. Facebook wants to connect their audience. It literally wants to connect the world, bringing the world together, I believe is their mission, or something along those lines. And the idea behind what Facebook wants to do with Facebook Lives is take on um, YouTube a little bit. So what Facebook are doing is actually promoting their... Um, this platform to more people. They want more people to utilize Facebook Lives and they also reward business pages that do Facebook Lives and serve or show your live to more people. So Facebook Lives are actually a fantastic way that you can build your business for nothing. And hey, if you get off the live and think, damn, you know, actually they're up there, you could easily boost the post to a wider audience, either people who are already connected with your business or if it's something that's appropriate, you might connect it to something that's external to your business and you can boost it to them and basically serve that live to the right people. A few things to keep in mind. Number one, really important to have a great headline, as you will have seen through the Facebook Lives we've been doing. Um, often a lot of capitals, a lot of pattern interrupt text, so it means people want to click. Uh, the next thing is to make sure that your headline isn't too uh, descriptive in what you're going to be talking about. You want people to click to find out. So it's a little bit of, you know, you ask questions or um, talk about something, you know, you wouldn't say, um, pec stretching for people who sit at a desk because it's too specific. However, you might say something like how to improve your posture at your desk and never have neck pain again or something like that um, that people might actually be interested in. So keeping your topics relevant to your audience and also just being willing to have a go. Most people, if they know that they should be doing lives but aren't, know that of the power of them are actually just a little bit nervous to start. Now we did a great workshop a few weeks ago where we are uh, in Sydney and we actually got people to do a live and I, I you know I kind of I kind of uh, it was a bit of fun we set it up so that they basically opened up their phone they had a look at everything and I'm like don't press start don't press go yet and they were like <gasps> like I'm joking it's okay nothing's gonna happen um, and they all eventually pressed go and we were walking around the room and you can go back and have a look at my profile feed on uh, my personal page and you can see everyone walking around the room having a go at this platform using Facebook lives now I wanted to share some stats with you because often what happens if you do a Facebook live on your business page Anybody who has liked your page will actually be able to see that you're doing a live. And often it will come up to say so-and-so is live if you are following their page, which is fantastic. So your clients and your potential clients are potentially going to see your lives. Now, what tends to happen is the first time that you do a Facebook Live, maybe not many people will actually click. You might find you do a Facebook Live, you get nobody joining it, you get no interaction. It's like, oh, well, that didn't work. Here's the kicker, guys. We've been doing 15 days of Facebook Lives, and if you've been following super closely, you'll notice that we haven't always done them every day. I was away for a couple of days in Darwin. I didn't have any internet. Uh, James did one of them as well. And so we've kind of, we, we've just been drawing them out a little bit. I've not had any person message me and go, oh, well, you've missed your live today. I mean, and also, other than this live, we've never actually mentioned it. It's just something we do. But here, I just wrote down some stats of when we started, how many people actually saw. So the first live we did in, in a while, we got 500 views. The next one, we got 293. We got 327, 87, 125. So if, if we were purely going, oh, well, the numbers are just, um, it's, not, it's not, not worth it. Like, nobody's watching. 
here's the thing guys by the time we get to one two three four five six by the time we do our seventh live there's 1165 people have actually seen it and this is because firstly the topic was super hot and secondly hey cat great to have you on here and secondly because we're starting to build momentum with what we're doing and people need consistency if you're going to do facebook lives don't just do one and go tick job done just be willing to continue to do it you don't have to do it at the same time every day although you might want to what you may want to do is actually look at it and go cool what could some topics be what what are some things that i could actually put in place that i could talk about and usually this is the stuff you just talk to your clients about. It's like, what do you talk to your clients about? What is it that, what are the conversations that you have with them? What is it that when you're in treatment, what are the, what is the few things that you are banging the drum about? I was known as the water Nazi. I had clients that named their water coolers at work after me. I've always, if I flipped this round to my desk, you could see all the water that I love to have sitting there because that's just what I do. I've got another lot of water over this side as well. Water Nazi. Really, really, really important to be well hydrated, guys. Remember that. This is the advice to give your clients. And I was always, always of the opinion that why would my clients listen to me if I didn't drink water? So water I drink, whether it's got organic lemons from my Nana's tree or vitamins in it or oils or whatever, I'm drinking all the water, I love it. Um, or usually pinches like sea salt, whatever, I love all the things. So anyway, the purpose is that you can actually find some topics that you are passionate about and talk about that with your clients. What I love about Facebook Live is that often the interaction can sometimes not always be here on the actual live what will happen is your clients will start to see it it'll come up in their feed and then you'll be in the in the clinic a few weeks later and someone will go hey I saw your video on drinking water and I've actually increased my water intake and I've noticed that my headaches have gone and that literally happened to me in the clinic it was before Facebook lives were actually um, around and it was awesome because it meant that you know I knew that the video that I had uploaded had empowered my client and that's the whole purpose of them now i'd really encourage you to play with some um hey christine great to have you on here i'd really encourage you to play with some different emotions you will have seen if you've watched any of the lives if you go back and watch them some of them is like hey guys leisha and some of them are more passionate some of them i'm speaking from my heart some of them I, i've just brought different energy throughout it because i wanted to play with it a little bit hey jason great to have you on here the other thing that I really want to encourage you guys is this awesome, awesome principle that we have that we talk to our core clients about all the time, which is progress over perfection. Facebook lives do not have to be perfect. I'm currently not wearing any makeup and I'll tell you why. Today has been a challenging day. I've had some fun times with my kids and I've had some really challenging times with them and there have been tears today. I have journeyed through some really powerful stuff which means that my makeup got cried off earlier in the day. And you know what? I could have easily chosen to not do this. I'm like, oh, but, and it's like, you know what? Progress over perfection. This is what I teach my clients. This is what being a role model is. This is what being a health leader is, is it's not about being perfect. It's about being real. And we all have hard days. And being able to show up in your Facebook lives anyway, and being able to give value to the world is what is actually really, really important. And if I can't model that for you guys, then, I, then it's like, it's absolutely not worth it. So as far as I'm concerned, that's why I'm here doing this live at, was it 20 to 10 at night? Bunch of you guys are up working anyway, which is fantastic. I love it. Thanks for the love, guys. Sending it through. It's beautiful. Progress over perfection always. So that is, the, that is tonight's live. It's all about just be willing to get out there and do it. If you're sitting on this live now, my challenge to you is in the next 24 hours, go out and do one. In the support network, we are running a free Facebook Live challenge and we'd love you to join. Obviously, I'll be sharing this into the support ne network as well. Um, if you're a massage therapist and you're in Australia or anywhere in the world really and you want to be supported in your business, we run a, a Facebook group that's free. Anyone can join as long as you're a therapist. It's called the Massage Business Support Network. So you're more than welcome. Jump on in there, get massively supported um, and we're running a free Facebook Live challenge for those guys um, over the next couple of weeks, which is going to be awesome. So I'm pumped. Have an absolutely epic night, Legends, and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next live.